fix it and finish it. The walls are bare and holes. And you got to go through this room to get to the rest of the house. This is like a dead zone. It is. All right. Don't scream. It needs some love. Sometimes the greatest problems need the greatest designers to solve them. Nikki Huggins is our designer today. She's one of my favorites. I'm Nikki Huggins for Fix It and Finish It. Nothing is going to be the same. Are you ready for that? Uh, yes. You've never seen anything like this. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. I'm really excited about it. I think her design skills are perfect. Today, we'll watch Nikki Huggins work her design magic on three very different spaces, transforming them and the lives of the owners forever. Open your eyes. Oh, my God! <laughs> my name is Antonio Sabato, Jr. Wow! Renovating is what I do, but helping people is what I love. Don't do it again! I've been designing and remodeling spaces for as long as I can remember. Yeah. From landscapes to living rooms, from bedrooms to porches, we all have that one space that needs a little help. You got 30 minutes, guys. Let's go. Let's move. With my experienced team of local professionals, every day we're transforming lives across the country, one project at a time. Oh. Ooh. Wow. This is Fix It and Finish It. We're on our way to meet Fred and Nita Johnson and their son, John. Fred originally bought the house as an income property. Half of it is business, half of it is their home. Between John's college and their business, Little Red Cupcake, they just don't have any time or money to put into this living room and fix it up. So I'm going to give them a living room they're proud of, like right now. All right, here we go, Antonio. Right. Here's our storage room. <laughs> OK. OK, yeah. This, the walls are bare and holes and Yeah, there's a lot of stuff yeah. going on here. We ripped the carpet up, You're and this is what we found. And you got to go through this room to get to the rest of the house. Right? Yeah. So you have no choice. You got to walk through here. Every day. Well, listen, the holidays are over. So I'm going to take this out of here as soon as possible. Before I do that, I'm going to introduce you to Alec from H&H &H Construction. And Nikki, come on in, our designer. And Allie. Hey. I'm Nikki Huggins. I'm in Montgomery, Alabama, doing a 1938 duplex for Fix It and Finish It. That's right. Ready? 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 <laughs> <laughs> All right. I think Miss Nikki is a great person. She's definitely not scared to work. Everyone on my crew for h and H Construction enjoy a good challenge. Uh, and this is it. All right, so Nikki, give him a little taste of what's going on today. Here's what's going to happen. Nothing is going to be the same. We're doing real wood floors. We're doing 10 ceilings. We're doing wainscoting. And we have a wallpaper that looks like whitewashed brick. Are you ready for that? Uh, oh, yes. 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 <laughs> yes. Fred says he likes that industrial loft kind of feel. And I'm bringing it right here to his living room. All right. So. Yeah. This. this is an authentic 1938 duplex. So the ceiling tiles that we're going to be putting in here are going to give it much more of a, a vintage uh, period kind of look. And they were provided by American Ceiling Tiles. The Johnsons have really high ceilings. And I was looking for a way to kind of cut the height of the space and make it a little more cozy. So these 10 ceilings are going to be a lot of drama, a little bit of shine, and they're going to just tie the room all together. Let's get to it, because we got to get on these walls. I know I'm getting a little worried now, because it feels like we got a lot of territory to cover. A lot. We still have all this flooring to do. And you know, that's, that's a big job in here. What we're going to need to do on the floor, um, we're putting down solid oak floors from Lumber Liquidators is a great product. So once we can get the wainscot up, we're going to run the floors. Once the floors are down, we're going to put the baseboards down. We're really going to start rocking and rolling. All right, really good. Right. Thank you. Alec Martin and Bo Sims are the top of the line. We have five different trades that are all working together for one unified goal. We're doing walls, paint, ceilings, electrical, and flooring. It's definitely a dance in there right now. I 
think it's looking better than I even imagined it was gonna look. Right. So these are the knobs. Let's see how they're gonna look. With the 10 ceilings, I didn't really wanna go overboard with any more silver in the room. And then I found these knobs from Imtech. What do you think? I think it's gonna bring it all together. Yeah, it's gonna be good. Coming in with the ladder. Coming in. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Did you move it? Yeah. Got it. Done. Next. The last really piece. Awesome. I was so worried about the tin ceiling, but it just flew in. Walking into space, seeing the design on paper, but then finally seeing it come together is an unbelievable feeling. Great idea. Great designing. Yes, this is coming together. All right. All right. That's awesome. That is looks great. It's time to get some furniture in here. Rug is here. I go here, you bring it back. Right under the window. I'm ecstatic about this design right now. I mean, it is everything I thought it was going to be and more. That's going to open and close a lot, so we want to see what it is. OK, we're good. We're good. Coming up. Open your eyes. Wow. Oh, my God. Oh my God. <laughs> and later. Kind of weird to have a washer and dryer in your kitchen, so I knew that had to go first thing. I'm really excited about it. I think her design skills are perfect. Oh my god. Keep your eyes closed if you can. Closed, closed. Step back. Step back. You're in. But well, wait. <laughs> Don't open your eyes. So, John, Fred, and Nita. Yes. How are you feeling right now? I'm wanting to open my eyes. <laughs> I'm so excited. I just want to see. I want to yeah, see. I'm just stoked, man. <laughs> just can't. Just tans and needles. Just can't yes. wait. You have never used this place as a living room. Always a storage room. Correct. Open your eyes. Could not have imagined this. <laughs> oh man. Oh man. Look, look, this is all this guy. This is all over the place. This does even not even look day. like the oh my Lord. Oh man. Oh man. <laughs> That's oh. Oh, oh man. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Look at you the wall. So Look at so <laughs> this. Oh. Red, red. Oh, oh man. This is incredible. incredible. I just this can't is... get over this. What we had envisioned and what you guys brought to the table is is so is, much more. Yeah. This is way more than what it I expected. It really is, it is beautiful. Awesome. This is beautiful. And it gets to stay here. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> we'll go right here because uh. this is. This is Big Daddy's spot right here. <laughs> this is I it. I love it. Lee. Amazing. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We're in Birmingham, Alabama. We're about to meet Melanie Boyer. Melanie's pretty happy with 90% of her house, but her kitchen needs some work. Melanie, here I come. All right, Melanie. Let me see your kitchen. All right. Don't scream. It needs some love. I have not been able to give my kitchen the loving touch due to finances. I recently had a kidney transplant. And because of that transplant, um, my life has kind of been put on hold as far as renovations. Nikki, Cameron, come on in. Hi. Hi. I'm Nikki Huggins. We're in Melanie Boyer's 1899 Victorian farmhouse. And we're doing her kitchen. Nice to meet you. Hey, Cameron. My name is Cameron Eden. I'm principal partner with Slate Bargainer Building based out of Birmingham, Alabama. You have the best designer. And she's got something lined up for you. You're going to be blown away. You want to tell her a little bit of what you're going to be yeah. doing? Yeah. First of all, we're going to have a kitchen island yes. here for you. Thank you. With a butcher block countertop. We're going to have a 
old fashioned Victorian plate rail all around the top Ooh. to give you a little more yes. height. Mm -hmm. Move the washer and dryer, which you're probably thrilled about, yes. right? We're gonna replace all these countertops. So I hope you're gonna be excited about yes, it. Yes, I'm very excited. We got a bunch of guys coming in, plumbers, electricians, painters, trim carpenters. They're all about to pile in here. This will look like a new place when you get back. <laughs> kind of weird to have a washer and dryer in your kitchen. So I knew that had to go first thing. to see all these people in my house, in my kitchen. I want to pinch myself. I, I, I just think I'm, I'm having a great dream. Melanie, I got a question for you. Oh, what's going on? I'm taking my anti-rejection meds, and in walks Antonio. How are you feeling? I feel great, but these help. These, these help? <laughs> yes, yes. And you got to take this medication every day for the rest of your life? Every day for the rest of my life. 22 pills a day. And what happens if you, if you do forget? Uh, if I forget, I lose the kidney. My life changes drastically. I lose the freedom that I now have. So a little birdie told me that you like plates. Yes. What we're going to do, we have these bird decals, mm -hmm. bird on a wire, and uh, we're just going to apply them on the plates. I'm really excited about it. I think her design skills are perfect. You want to keep the birds like family, <laughs> at least in the middle or a little higher. Middle or high? Yeah, a little high. So make sure that we can see them. Your kitchen has a Victorian sort of vibe, but mm -hmm. it's going to give it a more modern kind of twist. Okay. I'm loving this project right now. I love birds. I love plates. She put them together. What else could make me happier? Let's get started. You guys okay. grab a plate okay. and pick your favorite birdie. Doesn't matter if you get the, the bigger bird you or the You can have whatever one. you want. You okay. can put them together. You can group them. OK. This great is fun. Oh, I love it. Antonio's job. getting really creative See? here. Yes. See? This would be really cool. The kids' rooms, like on furniture, on bunk beds. Just oh, like yeah. That. They're all love birds. Now we're going to have to release you. OK. And um, so we can continue finishing the kitchen, and then by the time we'll call you, it'll be ready. I'll be ready. OK. Thanks, Mel. I'm excited. Love Thank them. you. Thanks, Mel. I really want a sneak peek. I would love to see what's going on, but I understand. So I'm ready for the reveal. Time to drop in the sink and get this thing done. I'm gonna go get her right now. You stay here and fix right. everything up, and I'll see you in a minute, okay? okay? cool. Hey! Hi. Are you finished? I am finished. Come on up. Can't wait to see what you've done. We've been waiting a long time, so there we go. Coming up. Open your eyes. Oh, my god. This is... And later, our third lucky family's living room is fixed and finished the Nikki Huggins way. You've never seen anything like this. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited! That's next. Antonio, thank you for fixing and finishing my kitchen. This home is 100%. We're about to meet Mike and Robin. They're a fun young couple. They're about to get married, and they live in their first home. This house is about 100 years old. It's a shotgun home. And we're going to give them a shot at renovation. So this is our second bedroom and office. 
This, this is a and, second bedroom right here? It is, because of this closet that's in the corner that is approximately this wide. I mean, not that you really oh, want to. Oh, that's really. a small <laughs> closet. Yes. <laughs> that's where I do my work, which is not in a... In the corner. In the corner. Mm -hmm. There's nothing to look at. You just sit down and watch... Watch the, the wall. wall. <laughs> this is like a dead zone. It is. <laughs> well, not after today, it won't be. Nikki Huggins? is our designer today. She's one of my favorites. She comes up with the most unbelievable designs. Hi, nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet I'm you, too. Nikki. Nice to meet you. Let's start with this wall. This is going to be your focal wall. And I'm not going to tell you what it is. OK. Surprise. But it's, <laughs> I'm going to say this. You've never seen anything like this. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. Because I've never seen anything like this before. Yes. First thing is the windows. We're going to bring the windows that should have been here long time ago. The second thing, we're going to add an accent wall with a tile wall, which is going to look fantastic. And third thing, we're going to bring brand new furniture. It's going to add a whole new look to the space, and it's going to look fantastic. What happened is, at some point, they lost this window, and the only window they could find didn't fit. We're going to get rid of this piece of plywood up here. So I've got these faux leather wall tiles. They're padded in this really cool caramel, kind of burnished gold color that are going to go on the focal wall. I just don't know if they're going to like it because it's so different. I decided to stripe the walls because I knew Mike and Robin loved the gray that was already there, and the caramel color related it to the wall tiles. Oh, yeah, it's great caramel color. It's going to match our focal wall. I can't wait to see all these stripes up, because this is really going to tie this whole design together. While Charlie works on the walls, our furniture from Better Way has arrived. Mike and Robin are going to flip when they see this. Coming up, open your eyes. this Murphy bed. I mean, it's period, it's solid wood, it's a great piece of craftsmanship, and it just looks at home in this space. We got some company wow. coming in. Look at this, guys. Anchored well against the wall back there into the stud. How cool is this? We cut the Murphy bed out around to the baseboard so it fit nice and tight up against the wall. Wall tiles are by Textures 3D. And when they said they were easy to go up, they were not kidding. Just a little bit of silicone, and you just push it into place. All right. So, to me, this is one of our best projects. <gasps> are you ready to see it? Yes! <laughs> Open your eyes. Oh my god! <laughs> this is not even the same room! <laughs> Go open that door. <gasps> Storage! <laughs> Storage where there was none. <laughs> yes, this is functional. Pull it towards you. Yeah, that's it. Bring it down. There you go. That's Holy moly! Awesome. <laughs> it's beautiful. Like, everything about it is, is, like you said, it's us. Like, this is exactly what we would want for this room. It's yeah. so beautiful. And then it's just easy to bring it's, it up. Yeah, yeah. Like, you can do it with one finger. Like, like I can do it. Like, like, one finger. Boom. Think. It's something obviously that we, we love. Yeah, it's amazing. Thank you so much. <laughs> we want you to enjoy it. We're going to leave you to your wonderful space. Enjoy it. By the way, happy birthday. Congratulations to the wedding, OK? Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you for making this day so special for, for both me and for Robin. Thank you guys so much. 
With the incredible talent of Nikki Huggins, we turned three spaces and turned them into rooms that were works of art. Want to know the details? Go to fixitandfinish.com.